number one, leading the way behind a man who very might well become the world number one one day. Immense promise in this 17-year-old Spaniard, Rafael Nadal Pereira, to give him his full name. So here we are. Switzerland's Roger Federer, the world number one, against Rafael Nadal of Spain. Federer is called. His three sets and cycles is on the And has won the toss, and I think he said he'll serve. It would be no surprise if he does. He has one of the finest serves in the game. Well, they haven't played each other before, these two, though I'm quite sure that Nadal would have seen a lot of Federer's tennis, and I'm sure also that Federer will have seen Nadal, because I think everybody believes he has a terrific future. He's a left-hander with a good serve, a double-handed backhand and a very aggressive attitude. He's a natural winner. You get boys who know how to win instinctively, he certainly does. He's got uh, great competitive instincts, wonderful spirit on the court, um, truly loves playing tennis, you can tell. He thrives on playing. He's one of the guys, he ain't playing just for the money, he's playing because he wants to be a champion. to say no, refuse to give in in that moment. This shows you what you can do if you're prepared to run for everything. Not a good approach shot, but sitting up. You don't have all day to hit that pass. Uh, not that one. Now he takes the new balls for Consolidation attempt at four three. <laughs> Love it, then. That's just an amazing backhand from Federer. It's actually a chip backhand. Classic shot from the young Spaniard, changing the direction of the ball several times, and then out of nowhere, the undersliced forehand drop shot deep in the tram lines. First point he's won, I think, from the net. Been a little bit of anger in that shot. belongs to the Spaniard. Six games to three, they've been playing for just 34 minutes. By six games to three. Well, there was aggression. As the number one player in the world, you do not let your opponent dictate how points are being played through an entire match. Well, this looks a little bit more normal, if I can put it that way. What can you say about that? Brilliant. 
most important thing is how Nadal is getting every return of serve back in play. And once he gets in the point with Federer, he starts to dictate the way the points are being played. Oh, there's the shot of the match. An unbelievable forehand, forcing the error from an absolutely astonished Federer. Look at that, will you? And he's so quick. That is the shot of the evening. It might become the shot of the match. It's given him a break point. And it is totally unnerved Federer. Oh, that's just too good. And where have we seen that gesture before? Remember another world number one? A right-hander who comes from Adelaide. Leighton Hewitt. And here is Nadal with the world number one in his grasp. 40-15, two match points. Well, a quite astonishing win by a young man whose progress is so fast, so rapid, that one wonders where it will all end. An extraordinary performance in just an hour and nine minutes. He has humbled the world number one, no other word, given him a lesson, out-hit him, outplayed him, 6-3, 6-3, and worth every inch of the win that he's just constructed. I mean, an unbelievable performance.